guys welcome back to my channel for another video it's morgan and today i will be doing a hair review on this hair this is from beauty diva's hair the name will be right here okay and as y'all can see she's looking nice but do i have some tea for y'all because this hair it really ain't that it ain't that popping okay okay guys so this is actually like my second time doing this video because the first video my wig was like a little crooked, and I was not going to post that because the wig was crooked. So anyway, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video, and follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is mini, M-I-N-N-I-E, two underscore, oh that's four, but anyway, two underscore peaches, P-A-C-H-E-S. Now let's get into the video. <laughs> with a 16 inch closure and it came in like regular hair color but I dyed it like a little brownish color if you can tell it's real cute okay and this isn't even like my first time purchasing this hair I purchased this hair another time and I end up dyeing like that hair red but I really didn't like it and I don't know why I brought this hair again to begin with because I really didn't like that hair but I end up buying it again and uh, I don't know y'all like to be honest like this hair can do like so good well this hair can be so good at like some points but then it's also bad like the shipping was fast I love that the seller communication was fast I love that but when I first got the hair it felt like real like dry and it felt like it was like store-bought hair you feel me and so I I was going to send it back because I was just like, I really don't want this hair. It feels real fake, fake to me. But I really wanted to make this to a wig so I could do this color on it. And so I ended up keeping it and I made it into a wig. So then I bleached it and it bleached well. Did everything good. So then I started like constructing my wig and I started really looking at the closure. And I was like, oh, this closure don't even like look right. And I had bleached my knots. But y'all look at this like to me, it does not it does not how act how my other like real hair wigs act so i was just like okay this is just gonna be like a little side wig for other stuff and so i remember i wore it to this party one time and it was like really like humid it was hot i was ready to go but as soon as i like walked out went to the bathroom and i looked in the mirror and like y'all my hair was like this like it was so like puffy and it really looked matted I was just like, yeah, no, this really ain't the wig for me, especially like to go to a party because that's really why I brought it because I didn't want to get my other hairs like really, you know, messed up and stuff like that. So I was just like, oh, let me just wear this cheap one to the party. It should stay like that. It doesn't like, especially when it gets really hot, like it gets really like knotted in the nape area. And baby, that's a whole lot, a whole lot. Of, I don't like that at all. I don't like that. So then after that, this hair also does shed. When I tell y'all it sheds, it sheds a lot. Like, I, y'all. Like, this is like some good, oh, I need this for like a week or so. Especially, oh, if you have a sew-in, uh-uh. Don't even get this hair, baby girl. If you're going to make it into a wig, yeah, it can last, probably last you a little long. Because I've had this since, I think, like, what was it october like my birth my birthday month i think i had this hair since october and it's kind of like on its last bone right now and like the like, to be honest ever since that party i have not been able to get it as bone straight as it used to get so what i start putting in there is this i start putting this cheese silk infusion in there i hope it focused but yeah, I start putting this in it and I really start noticing because, I don't know, it's like really dry. Like, y'all, I don't know if it's because I bleached the hair or what. It's just really like dry. And so I really start putting this in it before I flat iron it. And it'll hold me for like a good, I'll say hold me for like a good three hours before it starts getting matted again. Like, especially like in the nape area or before it starts like puffing up again. And then I just... 
to be honest, I really, I really wouldn't recommend this hair. Like, this is really just, like, some hair. I'm like, oh, okay, let me just go ahead and get some hair. I got a photo shoot. Or, oh, I just need to look good for these two days. Because that's really all this hair is for. Look good for two days and then off with it. It's just, mm-mm. But, <laughs> will I actually buy this hair again? It gotta really be like some dark times. Cause to be honest, I don't, this hair wasn't even that expensive. I think I paid less than $80 for this hair. And you know, you get what you pay for. So, I'm not really complaining like that. I'ma still wear the wig to the, to the wheels fall off, baby. <laughs> baby, I'ma still wear wig to all the tracks fall off. Because I brought it and I'ma get my money's worth. I probably have already got my money's worth, but. Who cares? I'm going to still wear it until there ain't nothing left for me to wear. Until all the tracks don't fell off. The clothes you got a hole in it. I don't care. Okay? So, I just want to say thank you guys for watching this video. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel. I'm a new YouTuber. I'm trying to get my subscriber count up. So, help me out. <laughs> and leave a comment down below if you have purchased this hair. Or if you were going to purchase this hair. Because... Baby, don't purchase it. Uh, unless you really, unless you really like struggling for some hair. I would say really don't purchase this hair at all. Well, thank you guys for watching and I'll see y'all later. Bye.